I've done one here. I, t I took a bit out of the World Service. Their pick of the world has got more interest in as social media because what I've, what I've realised is, is that in the, in the UK, the BBC promote their own cloud systems like Sounds and the iPlayer. Uh, but on the, on the World Service, they're, they're pretty much working with the same social media that everybody else is working. Um, so this this clip, which I'm not going to play, I can I, mean, I think I can play it. Well, I can I can relate to it in, on social media, but I don't think I can play BBC stuff on on phonic unless we've asked them. Um, there isn't any real content in it. There's just the intro and the outro. Um, but it's it makes it quite clear that they're working with um, Twitter or X and uh, Instagram and Facebook and YouTube. Those are the four social media platforms they're working with. And I think it's bbcworldservice.com that they mention on on air. And they, but you can't you from the UK you can't get there. You you end up on sounds. Um, but it's that's that's interesting. So in inside the UK the BBC is still the BBC, but outside the UK, it's just part of the social media scene, really. That's what that's my interpretation of that. Uh, so that's that's another reason why I think Twitter's worth persevering with, though we may have to go elsewhere. And um, 